everyone, welcome back to today's video. Welcome back to my channel. Today I really wanted to do an updated skincare routine because I don't know, I feel like I haven't done one in a really long time. And I might just be making this video because of one product I've discovered recently and I love it so much. I just want to tell the world about it because it's so good. I want to say that my skin is sensitive and oily. So just keep that in mind. Um, what works for me might not work for you. Just saying. I'm gonna get straight into things. As always, everything will be linked down below that I've mentioned. Let go. So starting off with cleanser, I use one by Ren. I can't actually remember the one I was using before that. I was using it for months and it was like my go-to. And then I stayed at my mum's house and I forgot all my skincare and I just ended up using her cleanser, which was this Ren one. My skin just felt so like cleansed but not dry. And it looked like really bright straight away. Like I immediately saw a difference when I used it. So I was like, damn, okay. I stole her skincare basically. This is the cleanser I use in the morning. Uh, it's a cleanser, it's super basic. I just wash my face with it, that's about it. In the evening, I cleanse with this one by Sunday Riley. I know Sunday Riley is more on the pricey side, but honestly it's pricey for a reason. If you do wanna like, I don't know, spend a bit of coin on yourself or just, you just want something a little bit more than like for your skincare, then honestly Sunday Riley is my top brand. Like I love, every single thing that i've tried from them this is the blue moon tranquility cleansing balm that is so hard to say with these in wow <gasps> see i've used so much of this i really 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 like this i use this to take off my makeup in the evening um or if i haven't worn makeup and i've just been out and i feel kind of like meh then i'll use this they're called blue moon and i like the name of it and i like the color of it and i just i like it i like this product i don't actually use a toner um oh yeah i do i'm lying <laughs> yeah i do i just lied okay i use is this one by pixie this is like a cute little like travel size as you can see run out like i genuinely love this use this all the time this is the glow tonic i feel like everyone speaks about this everyone has probably heard about this I really like this. This genuinely makes your skin so glowy. Again, if you have oily skin and you don't want to use products that are going to uh, like feel super oily on your skin, but you still want that glow, this one is for you. Because it's a toner, you don't feel it on your skin, but it still gives you that glow. Yes! This is also an exfoliant as well. It has acid in it. Like I said, I have sensitive skin too. So I don't like to physically exfoliate my skin with like those beaded washes and stuff because it will break me out so bad. So this is perfect. You just do a little swipe, swipe and you're good. Okay, moving on to moisturizer. This is where things get a tiny bit complicated. Number one, okay, we'll start with the one I'm actually genuinely using at the moment. This is by Akar and it's their clarifying face oil. And I know you're probably like, you just said you have oily skin. Why are you using the face oil? Well, I actually don't know why I use the face oil. I hate using products that completely dry out my skin. I don't like the feeling of it. I like to be able to feel my skin and it feels like soft and supple. Like products that are for oily skin really do that. They just completely dry you out and make you feel so gross. So I'm using the face oil. It works for me. This is all natural, all loving, all amazingness. Like for real, I love this stuff so much. I've used this for years and it's just great. I don't use this in the summer. I don't use an oil on my skin in the summer because it's a bit too much. But because it's so cold at the moment, my skin kind of needs a bit of moisture anyway. So I've been using this. Legit actual moisturizers, not oils, are these two. So this one is the Clinique Moisture Surge. And then this one is the Sunday Riley Tidal. So the Clinique Moisture Surge, I discovered this when I went to Madrid with Clinique in the summer and I used it pretty much all summer and I loved it on my skin. I really, really like this because it's a gel-based moisturizer, but it's Moisture Surge, so you still get like insane amount of moisture and glow to your skin. I use this mostly when I'm traveling just because I feel like it's the best moisturizer to go like deep inside your skin and rehydrate it all. And this one by Sunday Riley is the Brightening Enzyme Water Cream. And it's the same kind of consistency, like it's more of a gel than a cream. And this, again, like I'm obsessed with glowy skin. I don't know if you guys gathered that recently, but I really like my skin to be like super, just like glowy and bouncy. And like when you turn in the light, you can just see the glow in your skin. Oh, blue. I don't know why it gets me so much that it's blue. I've used a lot of this as well. Look, there's not much left. Mmm, this smells like green tea and matcha and it's like 
all the fun things on earth for real like it smells so good another thing which isn't a moisturizer but i do use it in replace of moisturizers sometimes is the benefit professional matte rescue i know they have i think it's just like the original one that they do this is the matte rescue so this is for the matte people so usually day to day i don't really wear face makeup i'll just use um, a little bit of NARS creamy concealer under my eyes and that's like pretty much it. Mascara, brows, done. But days where I know I'm wearing a lot of makeup uh, or I have an event, I'm going to be out all day. I use this instead of moisturiser. This is a primer and it's the only primer I like on my skin. You guys know every time I do a makeup tutorial I never use primer because I just, I don't know, I hate that extra layer on my skin. I just really don't like it. But this is really nice. This is a gel. Actually a legit good primer that I use constantly. This is a gel formula. So again, sinks like straight into your skin. This kind of mattifies your skin before you even start your makeup anyway. So if you're someone who kind of suffers with that like shine here and like in your T-zone, then you might want to try this because it's really, really good. Okay, now we're moving on to the whole reason why I made this video. The whole being of my existence yeah okay <laughs> the embarrassing thing is is that this isn't a product that no one's heard of and it's like a massive secret everyone knows loves adores this product i just didn't try it for so long and now that i have like honestly it's like wow it's life-changing to my skincare routine for real it's drum roll please Ta -da! Bang lotion this stuff wow oh my god it was sent down by angels in another life for real this stuff is just <sighs> so this is a drying lotion if you've never heard of a drying lotion before it does exactly what it says on the tin it dries out any areas of your skin so you put it on any blemishes you have any problem areas and it just dries it out completely if i have any spots on my face at all i put this on overnight and by the morning it's gone like it's completely vanished it's dried off it's gone it's not a problem at all i recommend anything from this video for you guys to invest in for your skin it's gotta be this guy i think it's like the cheapest thing in this whole video as well it's great for real so i feel like these products are a little bit pricey i just want to be honest with what i actually use on my skin i don't want to show you like a drugstore five pounds face wash and secretly i'm using one that's like 10 times more expensive this is genuinely what i use if you want me to do it update like drugstore skincare routine i can because there's so many amazing drugstore products for your skin let me know so that is pretty much my current skincare routine like i said if you guys want a drugstore edition or like my favorite drugstore skincare products then let me know because these are a little bit pricey but i just i love them so much really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already let me know down below what skincare you've been loving recently share it with us Okay, sharing is caring. So I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video.